Hello friends, welcome back to Telecom Talk. My name is Tanya Singh Thakur and today we are going to talk about something big. Vodafone Idea has pulled off something really big and it has done it in a very silent manner without informing the customers. So what is that one thing? Vodafone Idea has removed all of its Red X postpaid plans. Now if you are a prepaid consumer, you probably don't care much about this. But if you are an investor in the telco or if you are a postpaid user who was you know, thinking about getting the new Red X plans, now, unfortunately, you cannot do that. So what do you need to know about this? If you're an existing customer or if you want to buy a new SIM, we'll cover in this video. So please watch it till the end. And guys, if you haven't yet, please subscribe to the channel and give this video an upload. Let's go ahead. So guys, as I told you, Vodafone Idea has removed the Vodafone Idea Red X plans. Now these were the postpaid plans and these were the most premium plans that anyone could get in the telecom industry in India. Neither Jio nor Airtel offers anything similar to Red X plans. You know, these were amazing plans. They offered you totally unlimited data benefits. They offered you so many ODD benefits. They offered you so many international traveling benefits. Even if you were at an airport, you would have gotten complimentary lounge access but not anymore because Vodafone Idea doesn't offer Red X plans anymore. Now the existing customers who have already paid for the Red X services can of course continue to consume the Red X services. But if you're a new user and you want Red X plan on your new postpaid SIM, you cannot do that anymore, you know, because Vodafone Idea is not offering it either on their mobile app or on their website. So why has Vodafone Idea removed these Red X plans from its website? Now no one really knows about that because Vodafone Idea did not even comment on it. As I said, we reached out to the company almost a week back and we got no response. Now it could be because of Diwali, but you know, it doesn't really matter. We don't want to go deep into that right now. But uh, Vodafone Idea has to give something, some clarity around this, you know, because if I'm an existing customer, there's also lock-in period, you know, six month lock-in period now. Say I want to change the plan. I don't want to be locked in with this particular plan. Then what do I do? Tell me if the services are not there, Vodafone idea, what do I do? If the plans are discontinued, do I still have to be in the lock-in period? You know, questions like this, this need to be answered by the telco. What's really most surprising here is Vodafone idea removed most of its expensive plans. You know, these were the plans that could have helped the company in driving its way up you. These were actually trying to create a sort of brand for Vodafone idea. Now, one thing that you must know is since the telco has not said anything about it, these plans could be brought back in the near future, but these plans could also be dropped from the company's offerings totally because no one really knows what is really happening. So, uh, you know, you have to say 50-50 that these plans could come back or these plans might not come back or Vodafone idea could be planning something new around it or they could bring out revamp plans because this is not a technical fluke these are not so this is not something you know which happened for a day or two it has almost been a week since the plans were removed from the website and you know when we reached out to the customer care team of Vodafone idea the customer care executive said you know, this plan's not available on the website and the mobile app anymore. But if you want it, you know, you can reach out to the retail store, physical retail store, and they'll provide you with a new postpaid SIM with a Red X plan on it. So now what's the scene there? We have not really verified it. I have not really been to a Vodafone Idea store. But if you do that, please let us know in the comment section below. Guys, this was it for today. This was a small bite, but I hope you found it useful. If you get any more information around this, please feel free to drop it in the comments below. And if you want to know what Vodafone Idea is trying to do with the 5G, please check out the description. There's a link to another video there. Please check it out from Telecom Talk. And again, if you've not subscribed to us, please subscribe to the channel and give this video an upload. See you.